Hi everyone, welcome to We Draw Studio. Today, we are going to talk about mica. So now let's get straight to it. Mica is a group of minerals that belongs to the silicate family. It is one of the very few minerals that can be split into thin, flexible sheets without breaking. The name mica is derived from the Latin word micar, which means to glitter or to shine, a reference to the mineral's sparkling appearance. Did you know that mica has been known and used since ancient times? In ancient Egyptian culture, mica was often associated with light, purity, and the divine. It was used in tomb decorations and burial artifacts. The sparkling effect of mica represented the divine light that was believed to illuminate the journey of the deceased to the afterlife. In traditional Japanese art, powdered mica was often used by artists in screen paintings to create shimmering backgrounds in their landscapes, giving depth to the artwork and enhancing the beauty of the natural elements depicted. During the Middle Ages, muscovite mica was used as a substitute for glass in windows in Russia. This type of mica was known as Muscovy glass due to its extensive use in the Muscovy region. In the 18th and 19th centuries, European artists began incorporating mica into decorative arts, such as furniture and mirrors, to add a luxurious finish and create visually striking effects. Mica minerals are widely distributed in the Earth's crust. They can be found in various geological environments, such as igneous, metamorphic, and sedimentary rocks. Mica is mined in various regions around the world, with significant deposits in countries such as China, Russia, Finland, the United States, Canada, and India. Did you know that mica's most distinctive feature is its perfect basal cleavage, which allows it to be split into thin, yet strong sheets? The sheets are flexible and can bend without breaking, which is a unique property among minerals. Mica typically exhibits a vitreous to pearly luster. The sheets can range from transparent to opaque. Common colors include clear, muscovite, black or dark brown, biotite, reddish brown, phlogopite, and pink or purple, lapidolite. Mica is relatively soft, ranging from 2.5 to 4 on the Mohs scale of hardness. It can withstand high temperatures without significant degradation, with muscovite stable up to 700 degrees Celsius and phlogopite up to 1000 degrees Celsius. Mica's high temperature resistance makes it an excellent material for heat shields, thermal insulators, and furnace windows to protect surfaces from extreme heat. Due to its excellent insulating properties, mica is widely used in the electronics industry. It is a key component in capacitors, insulating materials, and as a dielectric in electrical devices. During World War II, mica was considered a strategic mineral due to its use in electrical and electronic equipment. It was heavily mined and stockpiled by various governments for military applications. Did you know that ground mica is added to cosmetics to create a shimmering or pearlescent effect? This is particularly popular in products such as eyeshadows, blushes, highlighters, and lipsticks. Mica is used as a filler and additive in construction materials, including drywall joint compound, cement, and concrete, to improve durability and workability. It also adds a metallic sheen to the surface of paints and coatings. In the plastics and rubber industries, mica is added to polymers to improve mechanical properties and thermal resistance. In paper production, mica is used as a filler to enhance brightness, smoothness, and opacity. Well, that's all for today, and thanks for watching. If you like our video, please click the like and subscribe button below. We'll see you in the next video.